match between United and Arsenal. The Gunners resting Thierry Henry for this one. Inside of five minutes, there were two confrontations between players, Sol Campbell and Ole Gunner Solskjaer, both up for the ball, and Solskjaer getting an elbow. That sparked some conversation. Then United's Rude Van Nistelrooy puts his legs across to block Arsenal's Martin Keown. The Dutchman lucky to stay on the field after that as referee Jeff Winter once again had his hands full as this match was getting ugly. United with a chance. Ryan Giggs rolls the pass to Solskjaer, but he was denied by the post. That one was close, but would not compare to the next miss. Beckham's long ball falls ahead to Giggs, who slips past Seaman and Sol Campbell, but to the astonishment of United fans, sends it over. 34th minute, Adu off the free kick. The ball takes a deflection and leaves Fabian Bartes completely stranded. 1-0, Arsenal as the ball hit Beckham's shoulder and flies in. They added another in the 52nd, Adu's pass to Sylvain Wiltord. He cuts across the middle, sends it rolling past Bartes, who's on his backside. 2-0, Arsenal as the bad blood between these two comes to a boil with Arsenal moving on to the next round of the FA Cup. Venable somewhat tentatively makes a walk that's greeted with derision here. There aren't too many in the ground who remember, it seems, what he did for the club back in the late 70s. But his more recent tenure as manager, some seven months, four years ago, was a very difficult time for Crystal Palace. Venables was manager of Crystal Palace from 76 to 80, then for six months in 1998. Leeds would score the first goal of the match, this in the 33rd minute off a free kick. Gary Kelly catches keeper Cedric Berthelin, setting up the wall. Not many seemed ready for the strike. The ball was in play, and it's a nice strike for Kelly, and it's also 1-0 for Leeds. Crystal Palace replied two minutes later off the corner. Julian Gray at the far end of the area beats Paul Robinson to tie the match at one, and the strike did take a deflection on the way in. Then controversy. Palace with pressure. Tommy Black at the far post. He feels that he scored this goal, but the referee, nor the referee's assistant, made that call. And Black is furious. Look at this one again. Black at the far post. The ball coming in. It would hit Michael Dewberry on the arm. Then it definitely crossed the line. Leeds were lucky. 73rd minute. Harry Kewell for Leeds with pace. Cuts it to the right side. That made it 2-1. Leeds with the victory. And Harry Kewell with the nice strike as they get away from Selhurst with a fortunate win. 2-1 the final. Tania Stadium, Chelsea scored twice in the second half. First, Jimmy Floyd, Hasselbank beat Steve Banks to make it 1-0 after 52. Then 14 minutes later, Jesper Gronkjaer down the right side. He goes short side on Banks. Chelsea, they are also off to the quarters with their 2-0 victory.